tutorial guys sorry for the lack of content lately i've been at european year contest last week so i didn't have time to film and uh, and uh, and edit any tutorial to this tutorial will be um kind of an advanced chopstick uh, combo it is a trick that i'm uh, throwing a lot lately uh, it's not that hard it's just advanced because it's a bit counterintuitive how to enter that this kind of chopstick because you're doing it with your throw end instead of your non-throw end as a normal chopstick so the trick looks like this it's a really short flashy trick uh, you can insert this into one of your combos to start off we are going to throw a breakaway and then we are going into onto our uh, throw end as we are doing a one and a half mount but instead of going into our finger, index finger we are going upon our hand and we are going a full twist like this so now if we slide the yo-yo finger across we are entering a, a inverted GT so we want to do like this, then we want to slide our throw end across and here it's, it goes the chopstick. So from this mount we want to place our uh, throw end thumb onto this rightmost string and go into a chopstick between our thumb and our pinky finger, like this. Like this. From here we want to take our non-throw end, you see that we have this rectangle and we want to place this rightmost string under the gap of the yo-yo, like this. So we are now in this mount and we have this uh, twist around our yo-yo finger, it can be our yo-yo finger or our uh, ring finger or pinky finger, um, this is just a matter of which finger you want to keep into this loop. While you're doing this, you can also place your uh, pinky finger, your sole pinky finger and your uh, basically like this. Okay, so let's say that we have our yo-yo finger in that, in that loop. Now, we want to swing our uh, non-throw arm upon our throw arm, releasing our the loop on the throw and finger, like this. And we want to land onto both strings. So swing, non throw end, release our loop here and pop the yo-yo up to land on both strings. You see that the yo-yo will tilt a lot during this uh, move. We are in this position, we want to release our thumb. From here, you see that we have this trapeze with the twist next to the gap of the yo-yo. We want to enlarge this loop and let it fall on the uh, outer gap of the yo-yo. Swing our throw end under the yo-yo and we are into a GT that we have to pop out from towards us. If you don't want to let this fall, you can just swing the whole mount around your throw end and you're into the same green triangle.
I hope you guys enjoyed this short tutorial, this short trick. Um, I'm unsure whether or not I'm keeping making videos once per week because I'm r really, really busy lately with my job. So um, it may be that the video starts to be released every two weeks. Anyways, I hope that you liked this video. Uh, as always, please don't forget to like, to comment and to subscribe. And I'm Diego B. Thanks for having spent a bit of time with me today. So long. Mm -hmm.